Hi, I'm James from Clever Touch, the UK Digital Signage Manager. What I want to show you today is how to set up one of our room booking panels like this one here. So first step you need to do is put it on your Clever Live account. Hopefully you know how to do that by now. Next step is we're going to go through exactly what settings you need to set up. So before we go any further, you need to ensure that the Office 365 room resource is created with read and write capabilities, because otherwise the panel won't be able to work. Second step is to go into the Clever Live portal Click on the logo in the top corner and press Room Booking. That will take you to this page. When you're in this page, you'll see there's a couple of options. Just skip through them for now. First step you want to do is you want to authorize it with your MFA. Log into the primary Room Booking account. And then from there, you just want to add new and add in all the individual rooms associated with that. So if you've got four Room Booking panels, you need to have those four Room Resource calendars added into there. Once that's done, go into the Screens tab. Now, as I said, you'll have had to add the room booking panel on at the start anyway, with your PIN code, just like you would anyway. So that should be sat there on the account with all of your screens, like mine are here. Once they're added, you'll see there's nothing on there, because we need to actually create something. So the first step is to go onto the Interfaces tab, go onto Room Booking, and then create the interface from the selection of templates in the same way that you'd create the normal presentations. Once you've created that selection of templates, and as I said, you've added your room resources in, you go onto the screens, go onto the room booking panel itself, press on the little edit button here, and then you want to press room booking for the, for the tablet. Once you've pressed that, you need to ensure that the correct room is selected, and you also want to select room booking presentation, so that would be the interface that you've just created. Press save. Once you've done all that, you should then see the room booking tablet change, put the interface on, and if the room has been set up correctly in Office 365, you should see the calendar appear and you should also see the red and green light depending on whether or not it's booked. If you need any further information or you're struggling to set up the Office 365, please get in touch and we can send you the correct documents. Thank you.